Have you ever seen two things that seem connected and jumped to a conclusion? Let me tell you a story about a young puzzle lover named Leo and his super smart Auntie Vera. Leo was visiting his aunt, a retired statistician whose walls were covered in colorful graphs. His eyes landed on one particular chart, Auntie Vera. Look, this blue line shows ice cream sales going up and this red line shows shark attacks going up. They match perfectly, he exclaimed. So, what's your theory? She asked, a twinkle in her eye. Leo declared, it's obvious, eating ice cream makes sharks angry and causes more attacks. We have to ban ice cream now, Auntie Vera chuckled. Leo, my boy, you found a correlation. That just means two things are happening at the same time. It's a coincidence, but it doesn't prove that one thing causes the other. But the lines are identical, Leo insisted. The graph shows they're related, but it doesn't tell us why. To prove causation, you need to find a direct link. Can you prove a shark gets a tummy ache when a kid eats a chocolate cone miles away? Leo thought hard and came up blank. There was no scientific link. When you see two lines moving together like this, Auntie Vera explained, leading him to a window, you must always search for the hidden causa. Third, invisible factor that's pulling both strings. Leo looked outside. The sun was scorching and the streets were filled with people heading to the beach. It's the hottest day of the year, he realized. Exactly, said Auntie Vera. Now, let's follow the real clues. First, when it's hot, what do people want? Ice cream, Leo shouted. And when it's hot, where do people go to cool off? The ocean. The pieces clicked into place for Leo. Aha! The summer heat is the real culprit. The heat makes people buy ice cream, and it sends more swimmers into the ocean where the sharks live. The ice cream isn't causing the attacks at all. Auntie Vera smiled and wrote on a notepad, correlation does not equal causation. You've uncovered the most important rule in statistics, Leo. Correlation is just a hint. Causation is the proof. Never let a pretty graph fool you into confusing a coincidence with a cause. Leo nodded his mind blown. I'll always look for the hidden cause from now on. That's the path to true wisdom, she said, patting his shoulder. Now, how about we go get some ice cream? It's far too hot to be worrying about sharks. So next time you see a surprising connection, remember Leo and ask yourself, is it really cause and effect or is there a hidden cause at play? Thanks for watching. Learn quick, learn smart.